We used to worry about, you know, um, uh, yeah, losing IP in terms of hard software assets um, that you've built um, or data. Uh, and now it's it's about the, the tacit knowledge about your business, the, the core competitive things that only you know or your staff know about your business that potentially an AI works out and is trained on. And, and so, uh, you know, many CEOs and my advice now is that the, that AI you're developing, you need to own it, you need to control it, you need to know where it's running uh, and what other services it's touching or what other AI capabilities is it potentially training. Because otherwise it's a little bit of like the Trojan horse that's getting into your organization that's, and uh, yeah. getting things out as well that you, you yeah. wouldn't want to. Uh, the guy I was speaking to was was saying, and again, CEO C of a very large um, uh, logo in, in America mm -hmm. saying, um, um, genuinely worried about some of his vendors becoming a competitor in the future, because they, you know, they they're potentially going to learn everything about how how they make money as a business through uh, the AI capabilities that they're building.